This is how the wave theory saved the atom. You see, everything is made up of atoms, but what does an atom look like? When Rutherford performed this very famous experiment, he bombarded alpha particles onto a gold foil and found that vast majority of these particles penetrated through the foil, but few of them came backwards. Based on this, he gave the planetary model of the atom where almost all the mass of the atom is concentrated in the center and the electron revolves around it, just like the planets revolve around the sun. However, there is a problem with this model. Since electron is a charged particle, a charged particle going around a nucleus should lose energy in the form of radiation and slowly spiral inwards and collapse into the atom. If this were true, atoms would collapse and nothing would ever exist. But this doesn't happen. Why? Because electrons behave not just like particles but also waves. Imagine a standing wave that oscillates with some wavelength so that the length of the string is an integral multiple of half the wavelength. Now imagine the same thing for a circular orbit where the circumference of the orbit is an integral multiple of half the wave. When we plug in the de Broglie wavelength of an electron into the circumference of an atom, we end up getting the condition of stable orbits. That means whenever this condition is satisfied, the electron forms stable standing wave patterns around the atom that do not collapse into the center, thus giving rise to a stable atom.